Hello fellow United fans, we have two urgent breaking news for this time. Let's get started. Eric Ten Hag hosts barbecue for his players and their families as the Man United boss seeks to build unity following a tough start to the season. Eric Ten Hag underlined the importance of team spirit at Manchester United by hosting a barbecue for his players and their families at Carrington on Sunday. The talk around Old Trafford during a bumpy start to the season has been about unity and fostering the same togetherness that served United well during Ten Hag's first season in charge. The Dutchman also wanted to thank the families of the players and staff for their support. The United squad turned up for the day which was well received by the players following an equally popular club-wide event at Old Trafford last month. The families were treated to what was described as a healthy barbecue, with a number of activities laid on for the children including a bouncy castle, face painting and entertainers. Ten Hag is said to have made his way around the room chatting with family members and thanking them for the sacrifices they make to help the players be at their best. The event is said to have been planned some weeks ago and sat night's morale-boosting win at Burnley meant it went with a swing. It has taken some of the heat off Ten Hag following a tough start that saw United lose four of their first six games. Three of those defeats came away to Bayern Munich, Arsenal and Tottenham, however, and United hoped to pick up with a run of more winnable fixtures. After winning at Turf Moor thanks to Bruno Fernandes' outstanding volley, United faced Crystal Palace at home in the Carabao Cup and Premier League before playing Galatasaray, Brentford, Sheffield United and FC Copenhagen. In other news, Jadon Sancho's saga takes fresh twist after Winger makes social media update. The Jadon Sancho saga has seemingly taken yet another twist this afternoon after reports emerged yesterday that the forward was not allowed to interact with the first team squad. The Manchester United forward had a fallout with Eric Ten Hag, and Sancho has refused to apologize to the Dutchman which has led the club to this sorry state of affairs. Sancho's teammates are also reportedly encouraging the winger to apologize and end the spat with the former Ajax boss, according to the Mirror. That seems unlikely as things stand, and the future of the Man Manchester United outcast has taken yet another twist. Sancho deactivates Instagram. Jadon Sancho has seemingly deactivated his Instagram account amid the growing speculation surrounding the future of the former Borussia Dortmund winger. Sancho's deactivation could mean a lot and also very little at the same time. The winger had received a lot of criticism on social media due to his behavior so this could be a result of the messages he had received. Sancho's behavior has certainly not been exemplary and has been made to train with the academy players. You wonder what these young players think of one of the highest paid players refusing to end their spat with the manager. Is there any way back for Sancho? Cristiano Ronaldo effectively ended his very popular return to Manchester when he decided to criticize the Dutchman to Piers Morgan during an interview last season. Sancho is seemingly going down a similar path which is such a shame as it seemed the pair had a rather close relationship last season during the 23-year-old struggles. Ten Hag will only allow Sancho back into the first team fold if he apologizes according to the Mirror's report, but that apology does not seem forthcoming. It seems the Englishman will be going down the same road as Ronaldo and will be on his way out of the club in January, similar to the Portuguese striker. If you enjoyed the video make sure to smash the like button and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the latest updates.